What's up guys? Recently there's been a lot of buzz about phone scammers because in the past three months, the Singapore police has reported that over four million dollars worth of money has been collected. And we've been wanting to do a video about this for a long time because it is an urgent problem. Just so happens that last Thursday, we actually got a call from one of these scammers. Now it's in Chinese, but Terence here speaks Chinese. Not the best Chinese, but some Chinese. So he's going to walk through what they actually said. I, I think there are very few operations in Singapore that speak only Chinese. Why would anybody be calling me, of all people, in Chinese? Uh? It's, you're setting it up for like a huge loss in translation moment. It doesn't help that he's a cynical asshole. Uh. But the thing is, you hear DHL, it sounds kind of legit. And they actually mask their actual number and they actually put, use a number that has a plus 65 in front of it to make you think it's a local number. I don't know if you heard the words phone call and package there, it's because I don't know how to say them in Chinese. Yeah, take, take whatever translations come with a pinch of salt. Because like, like we said, his Chinese sucks. If you've got any corrections, just leave a comment below. So, so immediately, you know, he's like, yeah, I'm totally DHL because I'm asking for your parcel number, you know. I'm not asking for your credit card number yet. I'm, I'm totally legit. This is the point in my head where I was thinking, should I provide him my real name? Dao Song. Chen Dao Song. <laughs> so that is a completely fake name. Uh, you sound like a Chinese table tennis player. Chen Tao Song. Does it look like a Chen Tao Song? <laughs> the fake name is so fake that even I don't know what words there are in it. You can tell by Terence's expression uh, when he gave the, the name. You know what would be funny if I said like Rajamutu, son of Chigren, but still speak Chinese. I wonder what they come back with after that. Oh, the suspense. Oh, uh, the Wait, address to Chen Tao Song. Yes, to Mr. And Chen And it took him, it took 28 seconds to just do nothing. He just gave him a purely fictional name and he came back with some bullshit saying there's a letter addressed to this fictional name. How f***ed up is that? Oh, brilliant. Wait, he's accusing, he's saying you have sent bank cards through the mail. He's saying that my name, my oh, name was on the package, parcel, right? yeah, oh, tied okay, to this okay. parcel. He's mentioned, you know, Shanghai Customs and DHL parcel. Mm -hmm. And so these are all big entities and oh, this is the part where I guess I'm supposed to feel scared. Ah, uh, that's not me. Then how could you have the name of the name of the name of the name of the name name of the name the name the name to commit this, you know, act of international financial conspiracy. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh. Suddenly I go from just some dude in Singapore to... Uh, oh, the Interpol list. Yeah, the Interpol Most wanted list. criminal. Oh. Oh, that so this is the part where they start, you know, really like uh, making you feel a bit nervous and maybe start fishing for a bit more information. And if you, if you think about it, if the person they've got is someone who tends to be a little more paranoid, a little more cautious, we got this call at about 11.15, giving a deadline of 1pm gives an hour, 45 minutes to lodge a report. Of course, people are not going to take the chance if they, are, they, they, they tend to worry about these kind of things. And there are a lot of people out there like that. Then I have to go to Singapore to go to Singapore. 
，因为现在现在是因为现在这个状况是从我们 DHL 这边发生的，这件事情是由中国上海海关来查到的，所以是由中国上海国际警局去做调查。At this point, I think we were we had parked the car, and so we were going for lunch. 我们在新加坡有很多人被骗的一个。一个东西也是不是你们嘛？您说什么被骗？我们这边有客服专线，您可以查查看。我们不是在骗人的。我们不是在骗人的。我们客服，我们的客服专线是八零零八幺零八零零零。如果你有问题，可以打这个电话给我们。I think he just realized that you just wasted seven minutes of his time.、Huh? <laughs> Luckily, we ended it there. But I'm assuming that if we did play along, he would have told us some authority to report the case to. Eventually, end up in us sending money as, as something that can be held as a deposit that will be verified by some bank there, and you'll get the money after the investigation ends. But the thing is, once the money is sent, it ends there. There's never a contact again from them. What we're saying is that this problem is very real and very urgent. And even if you think you might not fall prey to it, chances are you know someone who might. So tell them to be aware. You can share this video with them. There have been a lot of articles that have already been written about this. We'll include links to them in the description below. Do what you can to help them out. Peace. Hey, that's Chen Zhao. Chen Zhao. Chen Dao Song. Dao is 哪个道？道道。Chen Dao. 道吗？道。道哪里的道？就是就是呃，松。松是一个木加一个工吗？对，可以。一个木加一个工。对。好的。